So. Right. Um, more um, Gabriel Knight too. So, everyone, I did look up the uh, Vice Wurst, and um, apparently that is a very uh, special sausage. Um, <laughs> um, also, it um, would typically need to be uh, prepared the same day you eat it. Criminal, come sa leave. Call you uh, KKL, could I? Sit down. They call it a highly KKL? perishable food for good reason. It sounds like <laughs> very, very carefully heated up. Um. Anyway, let's speak to the nice policeman. What's the status on the case? There's nothing new that I can share with you. Hmm. Is there anything new that you can't share with me? <sighs> kind of a funny thing. Um, I talked to Grossberg's assistant. It was a Blue, clearly, but, but uh, she mentioned you guys took some of Grossberg's ledgers. I told you to stay out of our business, Knight. <sighs> true, true. Why did you guys take ledgers if Grossberg was just a random victim? As long as this case is open, I'm going by the book. That means a standard background check on the victim. Find anything? I don't think anyone's looked yet. We'll probably assign one of the younger men to do it. As you say, Grossberg was a random victim. Did I say that? I don't suppose you'd let me take an eensy weensy look at Grossberg's ledgers. Absolutely not. What if I could prove that Grossberg wasn't a random victim? You're crazy. Am I? Look, if you have information, I want to know what it is now. What information? Look, five minutes with the ledgers. If Grossberg was a random victim, my looking won't matter. And if not, I may be able to help you out. You get nothing to lose either way. I don't believe you know anything. No papers. Okay, well, let's just give him the... Never mind, let's exit the conversation and now give him the tape. And we are good to continue. If I can convince you I do know something new about this case, will you let me see Grossberg's ledgers? I'm listening. Good. Keep it up. Aber ich denke mir, dass die Polizei bereits weiß, dass unsere Wölfe nichts damit zu tun haben. Die können einen Test machen an den Körpern. Gut. Ihre geflüchteten Wölfe sind keine Killer. Was soll's? Halten Sie nur Ihren Mund. Sie sind damit besser dran. Aber Herr Neid, er kam gestern Morgen zu meinem Büro. Er hat viele Fragen gestellt. Worüber? Über die Wölfe. Ich habe mir gedacht, wissen Sie etwas über Großbergs Tod? Wieso sollte ich? Nun, ganz einfach. Ich gab Ihnen seinen Namen. Und? Du wirst... The letters first, please. Stata, bringen Sie Großbergs Papier herein. 
Danke, Stutter. Das ist alles. I'm going out for some coffee. You'd better have something important to tell me when I get back night, or you'll learn more about chairman law enforcement than you ever cared to know. Huh. I see we made another friend. Mm. Incidentally, I uh, earlier today found out about a subtitle patch for the game. Uh, I will not uh, apply it for the purpose of this let's play, but um, I may consider using it on a, uh, well, on a new playthrough. material. Excellent. That's gonna fly. Stand up! Hold the hell and play with the papier bag. Dr. Klingman from the zoo? Yes. He belongs to a men's club, right? And the guy that was asking about Grossberg, well, he's in that club too. Ditto the third guy, the uh, one with the personality of a pit bull. Go on. The guy that was asking about Grossberg, he was listed in one of Grossberg's address books. They knew each other. In the club, these fellas all patronize is only blocks from where Grossberg was killed. Coincidence? I don't think so. Good work. We'll have the club investigated immediately. You'll have to leave that tape here. Wait a minute. I'm already in with these guys. You go in there with your SWAT troop and my stool pigeon days are over. Sorry, but I'm in charge of this case and now I have a lead. I can't depend on a civilian to do my job. What's the name of this club? The Friendly Wanderer. It's near the university. Okay. I appreciate the information, but as of now, I want you to disappear. We'll handle everything. Sure, I understand. Good luck, Weaver. The tape? Sucker. Uh, well, anyway, we need to go here and uh, speak to a guy who uh, is not a friend yet. Hello, are you Mr. Dorn? Yes. What do you want? My name is Knight. I'm an associate for Grossbergs. Grossbergs? That son of a bitch owes me a lot of money. Now he's dead. Who's going to pay me, huh? I'll be handling Grossbergs' accounts. If you could just tell me what services you perform for him exactly, I can get you a check right away. I don't talk to nobody about what I do. Pay me what I'm owed. Maybe you and I can do business together. Otherwise, I've had enough of Grossberg and his associates. Mm -hmm. 
Yep, now Mr. Guy needs to um, just magically find massive amounts of uh, German money. Good luck with that, Mr. Knight. Except it's actually going to be quite easy. We just ask our attorney, who uh, apparently has deep pockets. Oh, Gabriel, come in. Hey, Harry. Could you pull some cash for me from the Ritter account? Sure. How much do you need? 14,000 marks. Are you sure it's wise to carry so much? I won't be carrying it long. All right. Frau Hogel, gehen Sie zur Bank und holen Sie mir 14,000 Mark vom Ritterkonto ab. Ja, schönen Dank. Perhaps you'd like to make out a will while we wait. How about if I just leave everything to you? I wish you would leave everything to me. Thanks, darling. Um, that kind of money, and just to give you an idea, I think um, in the uh, currency rates back then, that would be enough to buy a used car from an actual car dealership in pretty good condition. Fourteen thousand marks. Well, I'm off. Is a lot of money. Goodbye. Uh, or was I guess since they've gone over to use the euro now. Anyway, we have the money, so let's just leave. You have the money Grossberg owed me. Uh, this bit is actually timed. Easy come, easy go, I guess. So you need to click that before he slaps the door in the face. In cash. Come in, please. Not good, huh? The smell. These stinking animals. No matter how much I spray them down. They smell. Some creatures are like that, yes. I'd be interested in hearing your business plan here tonight. I think I want to save the game. Wonder why. Uh, 
I wonder what's making that noise. What kind of exotics did you get for Grossberg? Anything. Cats he mostly got. Things that make good coach, you know. Things you can't get on the market. But for you, you pay cash up front. I get you anything. Can you get hippopotamuses? Okay. Maybe not anything. But most things I can get. You need some cats soon, huh? Gorilla. I can get gorilla. Well, it's possible. I'll let you know. <laughs> hmm. Sounds like a very law-abiding citizen, wouldn't you say? Did Grossberg harvest the furs, or did you? Me? I do it. Well, they cost 250 marks extra, and they do a good job. You get the skin all clean for that. Not the meat. You pay more for the meat. Naturally. But every few months, Grossberg, he wanted the whole thing live. I don't know what he did with those. I don't ask questions. I think I know. Did you talk to Grossberg before he died? Yeah, sure. A few days ago. I called the bastard for my money. He told me about you, you know. He did? Yeah, sure. Said he had a new business partner. And that soon he would have much money and could pay me everything. I thought he was lying. Now you show up. It's good for me he was telling the truth. Yeah. Oh, Mr. Dorn, you are incorrect. I am pretty positive that uh, the guy Grossberg mentioned was uh, not Gabriel Knight but rather someone in the hunt club. And who do we know in the hunt club who uh, has some deep pockets? The good Baron von Sell. Hey, how did Grossberg's export go? Okay. Usually I bring animals in, not sell them out. I worked hard to find someone to take those too. Oh, uh, where did the exports end up, anyway? Taiwan. A zoo, they said. But I don't believe it. The restaurant is what I think. Do they sell wolf meat at Taiwanese restaurants? Why not? They sell tiger. Those people, they eat anything. There were two wolves, right? Yeah, sure. Male and female. Uh, could I see where you kept the wolf? Yeah, sure. Kept them both in the last cage on the right. The one against the wall. I think I'll save the game.
kidding. Yeah, that tiger is really real and uh, he's the reason or he but it is the reason we got the vice force. Should given what they put in them, but um, uh, well, the big log will live, I'm not sure. We did see something shiny there, so let's just grab that and run the hell away. I'm not sure what else to say. Hmm. Yeah, time to leave. And uh, I would say that it is also time to end the episode. Uh, the next bit coming up will, uh, if I remember correctly, involve a uh, quite lengthy cutscene. And uh, I don't have time for that right now. <laughs> so uh, yeah, you will see me again at the Hunt Club where we will go on a hunting trip. Stay tuned.